So she said, okay, look, I'll take you on if you bring, if you come, if you sign with us commercially. And I said, okay, great. And out the gate, I started booking commercials for them. And they were like, it worked out. And I was like, well, let's, let's talk about these uh, theatrical auditions though. And then within two months of being with this agency, I was on New Girl. Um, and that's such a story that you've probably told a million times. But the first thing I thought of was like, I wonder if you ever thank Damon Wayans Jr. for not coming back to the show. I wonder if he actually said thank you, because man, my shit took off. <laughs> All the time. All the time. <laughs> you know him. <laughs> yeah, Damon's the homie. Like we yeah, we always trying to develop together and uh he's uh he's the the best. Like he's such he, a cool dude. And he was so he was on the show. He was the pilot, but he had a conflict with another show that he was doing yeah. called Happy Endings. And so he couldn't do it. So instead of writing the character off, or they, instead of like replacing the character, they just wrote him off and then just hired you for the second episode. Right. It, that, and in a nutshell, that's what happened. It's a lot longer than that, but pretty much that's how it went down. Um, prior to it, I want to say, I don't know if he auditioned or didn't, but prior to it, I got an offer to play that role of coach. But I had a prior engage, I had a prior obligation to CBS. And I'm talking within hours. We were trying to get them to make an offer for me for New Girl after I had auditioned a couple times. And it was like, why don't we make him an offer? He's got to test like everybody else. And, and, and my agents were saying, well, because CBS is making him an offer for another show. And they were like, impossible. Like nobody, again, he, he's done a few commercials, but like, you know. And so CBS was, I was literally at the test for New Girl. And before you sign that contract, I got a call from my agent saying, don't sign the contract, we got an offer. CBS. And I was like, oh. And it was this pilot called The Assistance. It was uh, with TJ Miller and Heather Locklear, David Henry, Sarah Wright, um, Jason Jones. It was a great, great show. I, I, the pilot was really funny. The cast was amazing. Um, it just didn't go. And in that time, Damon had signed up to do New Girl, not knowing if he could actually officially do it because he did. Like you said, he had happy endings. Right. So everything just started working out. Him leaving me having me come back in for a new character that I auditioned 15 times for. You auditioned 15 times for, for your character. Yes. Well, 11 for my character, 11 for my character, I want to say, and then the other times for coach. 11 right. times. What do they need to see that they won't see if they rewound the tape on the first one? I don't know. It were, was you, a lot. were you doing anything like different? Would... Were you doing anything different? They would change the material up a little bit here and there, but I was like, just imagine that I said it, like how I said the other joke. <laughs> so like, what are we doing? But at one point I started losing hope. I was like, I don't think I want to. I remember the last part, the last leg of this audition. I tested maybe three or four times, I want to say. And I remember the last audition I had. I thought I booked it. And Jake Johnson it, it emailed me and was like, he was like, dude, I think you got it. And I was like, oh my God, that's awesome. And he gives me a call right back. Oh, so there's this kid. Uh, there is Justin Hires, and Justin Hires, he's on MacGyver right now. Is a fucking stud. <laughs> so when they told me Justin was reading, I was like, God damn it! Oh. I did all this for nothing. I was like, and here comes Justin's punk ass gonna take my job. And luckily, I I booked it. Um, um, but yeah, I mean Justin's. Doing it. 